Good morning, how are you today? We are going to continue Unit 3 for Primary 5. Today we are going to talk about, we are going to continue the grammar lesson, okay? We have taken before these collocations, okay? The activities that you can do at your home. Let's see here how to use them in the past simple or how to form a question in the past simple okay like this question what did she do what did she do so when you want to form a question or a wh question you start with the question word here like what where when and then we have the helping verb did did if you want to form a question in the past simple you are going to use the helping verb did, okay? So the first word is going to be the question word, what? Then it's going to be followed by did. Then we have the pronouns or the subject, okay? Then the main verb is going to be in the infinitive form. We are going to put the main verb in the infinitive form. So what? did she do and the answer you are going to put it or you are going to answer in the past simple like this she swept the floor what did she do she swept the floor so here let's do in the same example this example with number one what did she do she made the bed what did she do? So we started with what, then we have the helping verb did, and then she and the verb do. What did she do? She, we are going to put the verb, we are going to put make in the past simple. So the answer, she made, made the bed. She made the bed. What did she do? She made the bed. Here, number two, what did he do? What did he do? He fed. The past simple for the verb feed or for the verb feed is fed. So, what did he do? He fed the pets. He fed the pets. Here, number three, what did you do? What did you do? What did you do? I, you are going to change you to I. I put away the groceries. I put away the groceries. The past simple for the verb put is also put. Here in number four, what did she do? What did she do? She did the laundry. She did the laundry. Here, the past simple for the verb do is did. What did she do? She did the laundry. She did the laundry. What did they do? What did they do? What did they do? They took out. The past simple here for the for verb take is took. They took out the rubbish. They took out the rubbish. Here, in number six, what did you do? What did you do? I set the table. I set the table. So here, we have the verb or the past simple for the verb or for, or for set is also set. Again, for number six, what did you do? What did you do? I set the table. I set the table. Okay, please read these examples again and try to do it by yourself or by or with your parents or your sister or brother. Okay, let's see here the phonics time. Let's see here the phonics time. Here we are going to revise or to know another pronunciation for the, e, the ED, okay? 
Here we have when you pronounce ed like ed, ed, like dusted, greeted, invited, planted, waited, weeded. So here we have another pronunciation for the ed. Okay, let's hear them again. Dusted, greeted, invited, planted, waited, weeded. Okay, let's see. Let's see here in this exercise, exercise B. So here we have three sounds for the ed. We have three sounds for the ed. We can pronounce ed like t, t, as it ended with t, or we can pronounce it as d, 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 or we can pronounce it like id, id. Okay, let's see here in, in, in exercise B or in this exercise. Do they, do they both end with the same sound? Listen and put right or wrong. Let's hear number one. Painted, counted. Again, painted, counted. Do they have the same sound? Yes. So we are going to write here or to do yes here. Right. Painted, counted. Yes, they have the same sound. Let's see here, number two. Baked, baked, roasted. Again, baked, baked, roasted, roasted. Do they have the same sound? Do they have the same sound? No, they don't have the same sound. Here, baked, we pronounce it as t, t. But here in rusted, we pronounce as id, id. So they don't have the same sound. Here, the ed don't have the same sound. So this or here, we are going to write wrong. Let's hear number three. Here we have cold, 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 and waited. Waited, waited, cold, 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 waited, waited. Do they have the same sound? No, they don't have the same sound. Cold, we pronounce it here, the ed as d, d, d. But here we pronounce it as id, id. Cold, 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 but here, waited, waited. So we are, going to, we are going to write wrong here. Number four, we have needed, needed, folded, folded. So here we have the same sound. Here, the ED have the same sound, like number one. So here we are going to write, yes, they have the same sound. Needed, folded, needed, folded. They have the same sound here, okay? So here write, yes, or write. Let's see here the last one, number five. We have here dusted, sorry, we did, we did, dusted, dusted. Again, let's hear, we did, we did, dusted. So, do they have the same sound? Yes, they have the same sound. We pronounce the ed here like in dusted here. We did, dusted. They have the same sound. So here you are going to write yes. Let's see here exercise C. Read the sentences, write the numbers, then listen. 
An ant wanted a hole, so she planted a seed. She waited and waited and weeded and weeded. Then she dusted, painted, and invited her sisters for lunch. She greeted them with rusted beans. Again, an ant wanted a hole, so she planted a seed. She waited and waited and weeded and weeded. Then she dusted, painted, and invited her sisters for lunch. She greeted them with rusted beans. So let's see here. Let's match these four sentences with these four pictures. Number one, an ant wanted a hole, so she planted a seed. Which picture here? I think it's going to be picture number what here we have. Which picture is it? Picture C. Number one, an ant wanted a hole, so she planted a seed. This is picture number one. So right here, number one. Let's see number two. She waited and waited and weeded and weeded. So this or this sentence is going to be for this picture. So right here, number two. The, the ant here is weeded or sorry, is weeding the, the, uh, the plant or see, she's weeding, weeding the ground. Again, so here write number two. Number three, then she dusted, painted, and invited her sisters for lunch. Again, then she dusted, painted, and invited her sisters for lunch. So this is going to be for number what? This one is going to be number three. So right here, number three. This picture for number three. Then she dusted, painted, and invited her sisters for lunch. So this is number three. Number four, she greeted them with rusted beans. She greeted them with rusted beans. So this is number, or going to be number four. So right here, number four. Okay, so this is the end of the lesson or the end of unit three. Thank you for listening. See you next time. Goodbye.